Prometheus. Now that composition was written just after my final exam at school. Um, I had an hour to kill basically because I promised a friend of mine that I would wait for him for his final exam to finish. And so I basically, after handing in my papers, had like an hour with my laptop and could have done whatever I wanted really. So I was like, let's write another composition. And um, during English, which is the second of my A-levels for the last two years, we'd studied Blake and Blake was very into mythology. And so we spent a lot of time talking about Prometheus, uh, which is always has been one of my favorite myths in Greek mythology. And so with an hour to kill thinking about Prometheus, I was like, let's write a composition dedicated to his story. Uh, Prometheus isn't necessarily like a, a heroic figure like Hercules, but like he was punished for his actions by like Zeus and the higher gods. But he's not really evil, he's just like looks down on. And so that is why Prometheus as a composition is so powerful because it's based off this Greek icon, like legend. He's basically a god. And so the, the, I needed like full brass, full like everything needed to be like amped up to full velocity. And so, you know, I, I loved Prometheus because it was such a powerful composition and it was, it conveyed the character a lot better than I ever thought I could. And especially in, this, in you know, an hour, <laughs> like I didn't think I could write so much so well in like 60 minutes. And so I really outdid myself there and I was very pleased with Prometheus. <laughs>